Hello guys, it's your Auski from Gaming Pop. Today we have two topics. One is uh, how to be prepared for the next DLC. The next one is uh, the next Iron Banner. So the first thing or the first topic we are talking about is the how to prepare for the next DLC you have three things to collect whenever you play destiny legendary or exotic or a prototype in ground uh, tokens and gunsmith material so let's talk about the legendary Negram and the exotic and the prototype. Prototype, it's uh, each one of them. If you save uh, the legendary or exotic or even the prototype, it's useless. Will be useless in the next DLC. In terms, if you need a new weapons, they always will be saving the old version of the legendary in gram or the exotics or the even the prototype so after you get everything every weapon you need every exotic you need and every sparrow uh, <coughs> ghost emotes and uh, armor or uh, armament from the everest it's time to dismantle everything you get from the legendary engram and the exotic engram and even from Everest engram so you will get instead of that their uh, gunsmith material and the, the dust something dust so the next thing what is important to collect it's the gunsmith material and I will explain in, in, in seconds why you need them and the vanguard token or the crucible token or the crucible or an or the BVB token you will need the gunsmith material from my experience after you reach um, higher level or powerful level the max powerful level all your weapon you need to reach it out it will be best if you do it with the gunsmith and you will get also mods and uh, masterwork weapons and you will get uh, mods for the weapon and mod for the armor and maybe maybe even exotic from the leveling up in, in the gunsmith so it's wise if you collect them now and don't spend anything on anything now and the uh, vanguard token you will need it uh, or, or the crucible or both they will give you the next new weapon the next new armor the next new looking uh, ship ghost sparrow from the vanguard or even the uh, the crucible so it's wise if you collect as many as you can from them and if you are playing destiny frequently you will always be playing nightfall or uh, strikes these things will give you uh, tokens. I collect about 2000 before on the Osiris DLC, preparing for the uh, War Mind, and I was right to do that. Day one, I got that ship. Uh, I will show you in the in seconds uh, on the uh, gameplay in the background. background. So uh, it's Zavala Authority, I think it's name. 
and it was day one no one get it only me it was only me who get this thing whenever i go to strike nightfall anything on orbit outside of orbit with my friend with random people they didn't see anyone get these things so you maybe in the next dlc we will also get something like that so it will be wise if you save your token uh, another advice mm, if there is nothing else only the ship that maybe let's say you reach also level 50 in this season on this dlc to get this after you reach that stop stop doing anything after you reach the maximum power allowed without power falling around uh, it's wise if you save this and you will upgrade the uh, open the gram and upgrade with that the the armor or the weapon you like so I hope I give my thought and my uh, plans for what to do next uh, bye bye captain okay back to the topic uh, next I don't banner will be two days from now from today on the on the restart they will make it happen again uh, I thought it will be in August but they bring it now wise from them and we will be waiting for uh, the next uh, event the solitude of heroes or something like this I'm very very exciting for this next uh, event what they will give us uh, what is it about extra uh, I hope you uh, get everything you need from this iron banner uh, the ornament you didn't get maybe they will bring some new open or new ship ghost sparrow anything else what they didn't bring on the first iron banner on this season season 3 uh, I will be playing on this season 2 the whole week will be only for the uh, the iron banner if anyone want to join me on that thing on the iron banner I'm not a pro player I'm casual player on PvP uh, I love the grind there so I'm gonna do this uh, and that's it guys I hope you enjoy the play uh, the gameplay in the background and leave you to enjoy the gameplay. Thank you guys, it was honor to talk with you. Auski from Gaming Pop. See ya. the guy in charge and his big scary brother. The scouts I sent are the best in the militia, and even they were ultimately helpless against this. You guardians are a blessing. <laughs>